We're just underway here in Vail. Still to come, Olympic silver medalists Paul Wiley and Rosalind Sumners. But up next, the 1984 bronze medalist who many call the boss. I've always admired Springsteen's music, and I really believe that if uh, you know he hadn't come along, uh, the music could have gone into a completely different direction, and disco might have ruled. So he kind of drove the stake through the heart of disco, and I, you know, and I think that all of the, all of the rock and rollers in the world should be really thankful to him. Still to come, America's Karen Kadavy, the former world bronze medalist who's enjoying life at the top of the professional skating ranks with her husband, Brett. Colorado has a special place in my heart. It's just where a lot began for me as far as like making it to the top in figure skating. And um, I think it's been going really well for me. I've enjoyed it uh, quite a bit because of um, just so many opportunities that they have. and. Um, the type of events that, that they're, they're having right now for us and it's just been really wonderful to um, just to be a part of it and, and to be, have the opportunities um, and have my career be lengthened this long. Olympic silver medalist Rosalind Sumters makes Vail a traditional stop on her annual schedule, and it's easy to see why it's one of her favorites. Ros is up next, performing to a Broadway stand. I've been coming here to Vail for this show, I think this is my seventh year, and our year and our schedule is so hectic with airports and different cities and traveling, and this is a place that we can come to and totally get away from the rat race of life and be in these beautiful mountains in this beautiful surrounding and just um, sort of rejuvenate and sort of regroup for the year and it's become really an annual tradition for me and, and I hope to do it for many years to come. This is the first run of the season for me. Uh, I'm just crying, it's just so beautiful here. <laughs> but uh, great day for it, man. Colorado, just nothing beats it. Olympic silver medalist Paul Wiley is next when the Vail Figure Skating Festival continues. A brisk is cat. such a wonderful father because he's such a child himself. Thank you. <laughs> means an IQ and everything that goes along with that, too. Look at these. 1984 oh. Olympic silver medalists Kitty and Peter Carruthers return to Vail as different people this year. Kitty as a new mother and Peter as an expectant father. When we return, they'll reunite I think for we're a special shopping. performance. No more shopping. This is it. This is it. It's all they're going to get. Elaine Zayak is one of five skaters in tonight's cast to have competed in Sarajevo in 1984. We have a sense of, of, of reunion and family and togetherness that we had there, and it's now I wish that maybe we could have gone back there someday, but that'll never be, and it's very sad and heartbreaking for all of us, I think. And on top of that, all the lives that have been lost. When we return, Elaine gives us her tribute to this war-torn city. I've been working on some new numbers for um, competitions this year and just trying to make myself um, look differently and grow as a skater. I was stuck in kind of that tough guy West Side Story thing and I wanted to do something new this year and that's my main goal. 
stay tuned. This night's about to turn wild with the United States champion Scott Davis when the Veil Figure Skating Festival continues. Still to come, the magic of Russian ice dancers Natalia Aninko and Genrik Stratinsky when the Veil Figure Skating Festival continues. It's the clear Olympic silver medalist Roslyn Sumners and Paul Wiley return to the ice when we return to Vail. Oh, yeah. 